Each week we bring you stories of athletes who are outstanding for a variety of reasons. Reporter Jack Washer joins us now with the story of two South Bay soccer stars who are getting attention on the national level. That's right, Robert. Emily Smith and Naomi Germa are two of the top girls soccer players here in the Bay Area. They've captured the attention from everyone around here, but now they're taking their games to the national stage. When Naomi Germa steps out onto the soccer field, it's clear she's a special player, but she isn't your typical athlete. You just have a, a gifted athletic player that just wants to play the game and is inspiring others around her uh, with her play, with her demeanor. The benefit she provides for her team doesn't always show up in the stats, but numbers don't define her game. She could easily have, you know, 23 goals here in four games, but that's not the case. She's spreading the wealth. And, you know, I challenge anybody to find another player that's like that. Three miles across town at Lee High School. Yeah. Emily Smith is dribbling by defenders. She gets the ball and she sees a defender coming out here and she just stands there and you can see she's just like, oh, I'm going to beat you. <laughs> Germa and Smith are two of the best girls soccer players in the nation. They made the U.S. U-17 national team and will represent Team USA, pairing them with the best of the best. It's an honor to represent my country. It's really, really exciting and it's just overall been a really humbling experience. Everyone's like normal, so they're not like, like you would think they'd be different, but everyone's cool and normal, so it was a good experience. The commitment to U.S. soccer requires both girls to miss time from their high school team. Their coaches understand, but celebrate their return. When she comes back, it, you know she's missed and the girls really get pumped up uh, and their intensity increases just, just with her presence on the field. Two girls who are playing at the highest level with the national team, on top of eight to nine months with their club teams, chose to play high school soccer something some club players avoid. But Emily and Naomi want to play. It's not about the spotlight for them. It's about being a high school athlete. Love the high school environment, just being with like our school friends and then like, coming out here and playing in a game. I just like love the friendly environment. Here she's with her friends. She gets to hang out with them afterwards and, and gets to uh, talk to them and experience life with them outside of the rigmarole of a, of a crazy, hectic life she has. This is a break from club. You're supposed to be having fun, staying fit, working hard and getting better, but you know, you're just out here to have fun. It's not, it's not about getting anywhere. Missing time from their teams also means missing school. Just another challenge, they're kicking out of the way. Time management and like how to do my homework and go to practice and like hang out with people and still like not feel like soccer's taking over my life. Two top athletes representing their school, their city, and their country. Their talents will take them many places, but the memories they make here with their high school friends are the ones they'll cherish forever. Well, Emily and Naomi were both excited when they found out another girl from the Bay Area was on the U-17 national team. It was so exciting. I was like, I asked uh, Naomi, I was like, so you guys are best friends? She's like, we're working our way there. Um, I was like, so what do you have in common? She's like, we both like the Warriors. I'm like, that's a great place to start. It is. Who doesn't like the Warriors? Yeah, who doesn't like the Warriors? Marissa, <laughs> no, you don't like the Warriors. I like the Warriors. Former Laker fan. <laughs> no. Unbelievable. <laughs> No, no, no. See, I'm putting me on blast over here. All right. Synergy Environmental Solutions cleans up environmental hazards.